South Australia's resource sector is facing another blow with US giant Chevron Exploration pulling out of a major project in the Cooper Basin. The government says Beach Energy will find another partner, but the opposition says it makes a mockery of promises to create thousands of new jobs. The first stage of the gas exploration project in the Cooper Basin is complete, but Chevron announcing today it won't be going ahead with Beach Energy for the next step. But the reality is, is that commodity prices are down. When commodity prices are down, uh, investors flee. Uh, the government continues to be in a state of denial. The opposition says this announcement and recent resource sector job cuts make a mockery of the government's promise to create 5,000 jobs by 2017. Wayala-based Arium was forced to slash 600 jobs in January, BHP another 300 from Olympic Dam and Santos cutting 500 jobs due to the plunging oil prices. The opposition claims it also cast doubt on the state government's ability to deliver on the Gilman land deal, which planned to create an industrial hub that could support 6,000 jobs. Time's going to tell whether or not uh, an oil and gas hub was a realistic promise or a defence that the government's been using. What my concern is, is why the Liberal Party is trying to politicise what's basically a market decision because the price of oil is halved. With stage one of the gas exploration project already complete alongside Chevron, Beach Energy says it's currently reviewing the objective for the next step. That includes determining future partnership opportunities. The government says it's already looking promising. One person's exit is another person's entry point. Hannah Dawkins, Nine News.